back with another video you guys and I welcome you to Lena's Kitchen and I am so glad to be here before you guys today and I thank you for watching my videos um I thank my new subscribers I appreciate you guys very much I have got a lot of new subscribers and I thank you so much um I just want to come to you um today because I want to make a smoothie um, I had did breakfast earlier, which was the French toast. So now it's like mid-afternoon. So I would like to have something else. So I chose to have a smoothie. And I want to share with you guys. But before I get started, um, I said that I had needed new equipment um, since my daughter had left. And I had to do this thing on my own. This morning was, well, this was officially my first morning using my new equipment so I'm trying you guys but I did go and buy me a pro gorilla pad uh, gorilla pod bought that and I bought me a 60 inch well 66 um, three-way um, pan and tilt head tripod that stand up so I'm serious about this, y'all, so I'm trying to get it together, so just bear with me. But, come on in Lena's Kitchen, shut the dough, and we're going to go ahead and make this smoothie because I'm ready to drink it, you guys. Okay, so what I have here, I have some frozen berries, and then I also have some mixed um, strawberries with pineapples, apples, and um, mango. Let me wash my hands. I did touch it, but I did wash my hands because y'all were trip. So, just going to make this real quick. Now, what I'm going to do, you guys, I'm going to add a little ice. Some people don't add ice because they already have frozen vegetable. I mean, frozen fruit. I'm thinking about food, y'all. They have frozen fruit. So, within that, it has its own water or juices. But, I want mine cold. So, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to add a little ice. I had cut up some ice. Not cut up some ice, broke up some ice. Just a little bit. Then, I'm going to add my blueberries. With the other mixture of um, fruit. And I have some fresh strawberries that I didn't want to go to waste. And I also gonna put in there some um, lemon juice. this would be about a tablespoon and a half and I'm going to add a cup of almond milk and I'm going to add about a tablespoon um, of um, honey that's probably about a tablespoon and a half okay so Ready to mix it up, you guys. Let's do this again. See, this is what I didn't want to happen, you guys. But things happen. Things happen. I might need to put a little bit more in. Let me see, it might be a little thick. I'm going to add a little water, you guys. Should add some more ice, but just a little water. Ain't going to hurt nothing. Let's do it again. There we go.
Alrighty, y'all. So we're going to taste it. What I forgot to put in here was spinach. Next time, I'm going to make sure I put my spinach in, you guys. So we're about to see how it go. Maybe I need to go out. Ooh, ooh. Uh oh. I don't think this one to stand up in there. Okay, you guys. This is my finishing results. <clears throat> so I should say, now. It is so good. But you know what? I didn't put a lot of honey in here, which I could add a little bit more. But other than that, y'all... Let me take this thing out. But other than that, y'all, this is really good. Fulfilling. Healthy. So if you want something to drink, you done ate all, already ate your breakfast with me. Get this. Have a good one, y'all. See you later.